AE lock with hold feature. Auto exposure lock is an excellent method of controlling exposure without losing the speed and convenience of automation. AE lock freezes the camera's exposure settings. For example, if you're shooting a portrait and want to place the subject off center, take a meter reading off the subject first. AE lock then allows you to lock in that meter reading before moving the camera to recompose the subject. This ensures that exposure won't shift if the background is lighter or darker than the subject itself. The problem with traditional AE lock is that it's difficult to keep a reading in place for any length of time or for more than one or two pictures at a time. Canon's new AE lock and hold addresses this problem. AE lock and hold changes how AE lock functions. Once AE lock and hold is activated, exposure remains locked until auto power off kicks in and the entire camera goes into sleep mode. AE lock and hold makes it easy to use auto exposure to quickly get to a desired exposure and then lock in that reading for as long as you need, regardless of how many shots you take. If you adjust the auto power off time, a locked exposure can be held up to 30 minutes. Or, if auto power off is disabled, the camera will hold the exposure until you turn the camera itself off. To designate which button will activate the hold function, go to the custom controls in the second custom functions menu. You can now assign AE lock with hold to one of several buttons. The AF on button, the AE lock button, the depth of field preview button, the multifunction button, or the lens AF stop button on certain Canon Super Telephoto lenses. It's now also much simpler to manually turn off AE lock. When AE lock withhold is active, just press the designated button again to clear it and return to normal operation. The AE lock and hold feature makes AE lock a lot more practical when you want to use it for more than one or two pictures at a time. And it even makes it easier to clear when you want to return to normal auto exposure. We recommend if you use auto exposure frequently, to try the new AE lock withhold feature and see how it fits into your shooting routine.